the top person on the leaderboard actually has 415 trillion steps. Woohoo! I have 1 trillion steps, and I thought I was fast. <laughs> Okay, so let's check out the original Unstable Trail. This is it right here. So what's really cool is that it actually was here for a Halloween update. Maybe that's why it's actually orange. All right, so now I'm going to show you guys where the actual Unstable Trail, the original Unstable Trail, was actually purchased at. No way. You are now watching James the Noob King. for another exciting video if you haven't already please do not forget to like and subscribe what's up guys and welcome back to the channel today should be a really fun video and it is friday guys i am super excited for the weekend and i hope you guys are having an amazing day all right guys so today's video is going to be really fun actually if you guys saw yesterday's video then you know that it was about the original Unstable Trail and the original Timeless Trail. That was definitely a fun video, and surprisingly, a few people didn't even know what the original Unstable was. So today, we're going to talk about the original Unstable, and we're going to talk about where it actually came from, and I'm going to show you guys the actual crate that it came from. So this should be a really fun video, guys. And if you haven't already, please do not forget to like this video, guys, because this is going to be an awesome video. And don't forget to share this video as well. All right, guys, so Speed City is obviously an awesome game, and it has a lot of trails. And yeah, there are a lot of trails that are actually super old, and there are a lot of really rare trails in this game. And today we're going to talk about one of the rarest trails ever, which happens to be the rarest unstable trail. And the rarest unstable trail is... The original unstable? Mostly because you cannot get it anymore, so yeah. We're going to be talking about this trail today, guys, and I'm going to show you guys where the crate was actually located, and I'm going to show you guys what the original unstable trail's crate actually looked like. So this should be really fun, guys. All right, so first we're going to go to the beach area right here, all right, so right behind me, right over here, as you guys can see, there is an unstable crate and an unstable shop. This shop right here actually sells a lot of cool trails and they're all unstable trails, but these unstable trails are very, very new. So obviously this crate is not super new, but it does sell a bunch of newer unstable trails. All right, so now I'm going to show you guys where the actual Unstable Trail, the original Unstable Trail, was actually purchased at. Let's go back to the main area. All right, so we are at the main area, guys. Look at this. This is the starter area in Speed City. And yeah, this place is definitely awesome. Okay, so we're going to go right over to the leaderboard. Okay, so here's the leaderboard. Shout out to everyone on the leaderboard. Yes. Um, wow. Look at that, guys. The top person on the leaderboard actually has 415 trillion steps. Woohoo! I have 1 trillion steps, and I thought I was fast. <laughs> That's amazing. All right, so right here next to the leaderboard was actually a new crate about almost a year ago. Last Halloween, actually. So there was a crate right here, and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like right now. All right, so this is the crate that the original Unstable Trail actually was purchased from, and it actually had other trails in there too, which are rare now. I believe it was some pumpkin trails. And this crate actually had a pumpkin right next to it, which is actually super cool and a little different from all of the other crates. And what's really cool is that if you had 13,000 steps or more, you could purchase from this crate. But if you had even more than that, I think it was like 130 million or 130,000 or something, then you can purchase the better trails out of this crate, which was even cooler, guys. So this crate was definitely awesome, and it was an orange crate, so it was totally different from all of the other crates. And hopefully we get another Halloween update like that. Um, this Halloween, we might not, guys, but that would be really cool if we actually did. Okay, so let's check out the original Unstable Trail. This is it right here. So what's really cool is that it actually was here for a Halloween update. Maybe that's why it's actually orange. 
I don't know. This is a really cool trail, so we're going to check it out right now. And this trail has a step multiplier 199, orb multiplier 199, and jump multiplier 4. So let's equip this trail right now. Okay, so this is the unstable trail, the original unstable trail, and this trail is super unique. Let's see if it actually changes. Because mostly it's orange, but it does change into a rainbow trail. Um, come on. <laughs> there it goes. There it goes. It changed. Ah, and now it's back. Okay, let's try it again. And this trail changes into a rainbow trail. There it goes. Super cool. And this trail might actually just be orange because it was here for a Halloween update in Speed City. And the crate was right here, like I said before. And it's really cool because this trail was for sale for steps. And then after this trail was not for sale for a while, then this trail became for sale for Robux. And you could actually purchase it with Robux for a little while. And now it is super rare and you cannot purchase this trail at all. So that is sad that this trail did not stay here forever, but there are a lot of new trails that are super cool in Speed City as well. So this trail is super rare now. It is not for sale anywhere in Speed City anymore, and it is a very cool trail. The original Unstable basically is the first Unstable in Speed City, and it is not for sale anymore which is kind of sad. All right, guys, well, that is it for this video. If you haven't already, please do not forget to like, subscribe, and share this video, and I will see you guys on the next video.